Kamikaze getting warmer. Brakes. Oh, oh, he's pretty good. <laughs> they work. We've set up a challenge. We have the Volvo FH with the dual clutch gearbox, and we're going to be racing against the Koenigsegg 1 to 1 Mega Car. Today, we're really going to see how that gearbox performs in a tough track condition. Ooh, five reds, wait till they go off. This is the setup for Volvo Truck's new online film, Volvo Trucks versus Koenigsegg, set at the Swedish racing circuit Rinkenutstorp, starring former racing driver Tiff Nidell. But the real question here is, why compete with a truck on a racetrack? When we launched this new gearbox, we did it under the tagline, under the hood, it's a sports car. And now it's uh, time to prove that. The ring Knutstorp is perfect for testing the dual clutch gearbox because it has lots of twists and turns and tough gradients, and it's really going to make that dual clutch gearbox work. It's a perfect environment to see how it performs. But the Volvo FH isn't up against just any sports car. It's a Koenigsegg one-to-one, -one, the first series produced car in the world with a one-to-one -one power to weight ratio. The truck, on the other hand, is built for long haul driving on highways. So the rules of the game had to be set accordingly. Two laps for the Koenigsegg, one for the truck. It was a challenge because uh, uh, the, the truck is quite fast and, and going double the distance uh, it was a really tough challenge. But we're quite confident uh, about what we do and what our car can do, so we were up for it. What the Koenigsegg team doesn't know is that Volvo Trucks has a secret weapon. There's a legal obligation in Europe that all trucks are limited to 90 kilometers an hour, for safety reasons, of course. However, here at Knutsthorpe Ring, we've actually removed the speed limiter on the truck just to give us a little edge, a little bit more of a chance to catch that Koenigsegg. We're nearly there. Where's the mirrors? <laughs> We're doing 125 kilometers an hour on the straight and almost nudging 130, which is pretty unique for a normal long haulage truck. Oh, he's not coming through there. Oh, he's In not the end, the Volvo FH oh, did put up a really good oh, fight, even though the Koenigsegg 1 to 1 still inched by to win. Oh. However, Volvo trucks still proved their point that the truck really is a sports car under the hood. Well, the FH was brilliant. I mean, the, the dual clutch gearbox was changing up and down like mad and gave us as much speed as we could possibly want. It just wasn't quite enough, but it was huge fun wheeling the truck. It looks like a big truck, but funny enough, when you're driving, it, it feels quite small on the track once you get used to it. 